welcome to a YouTube video. I'm Austin slash Parfait. And I'm Chris slash Ox. And together we're downtown Kentucky, baby. Yeah. I don't know what that was. We'll <laughs> I don't either. But yeah, we're here. We're back. We're going to do another episode of Ring of Champions. If you don't know what it is, go watch one of the other ones. I don't want to explain it every video. Uh, yeah. So, without any further ado, it's time for the show within a show. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Ring of Champions. My name is Frankie Fingers, and I am joined as always by Sir Reginald Chambers. Why, thank you, Frankie, thank you. It's a pleasure to be calling the show with you. And it, what a show we have today. We are we got our normal tournament action. Five amazing matches in the tournament bracket. That's right. Then we have as always. the opener. Which is yeah, that's right. We're opening with a King of Flight title match with Shadow the Hedgehog versus Spider Man. Can you believe it, folks? Absolutely insane. Spider-Man, who, you know, just happens to be in the main event fighting Goku in tournament action. Goodness. So, due to the fact that Spider-Man has to work double duty, Shadow will also be working double duty as he will be facing Knuckles later on tonight. It will only be fair, but to make sure that neither man is at disadvantage for the championship belt, they will be facing off first tonight. Absolutely. And we'll get to the other matches when we get to them, but without any further ado, I think it's time to show them that tight, uh, match card, match graphic. As do I. Ooh. Yes. And there it is, folks. Absolutely <sighs> lovely, as always. King of Flight, Shadow the Hedgehog the Challenger, taking on Spider-Man. Please don't crash. Please, it would be very nice if we could manage to maintain power through the whole of the night. Ooh, I know it's that's... not going to happen, but it's what I would like. Here comes our challenger, Shadow the Hedgehog. Had an impressive showing in the tournament, I believe. Yes, Shadow the Hedgehog, who is primarily known for his marksmanship, showing off his fighting skills in Shadow... the Ring of Champions. Yeah, Shadow is so far undefeated in the tournament. Right. Truly on the come up, as they would say. Spider-Man is as well, but he's only had one match while Shadow's had two matches. Mm. In block competition. But also, Spider-Man every week, when he's not in block competition, has been defending his Ring of Champions title. That's alright. Here we go, folks. Our your referee is Slimer in this championship contest between mm -hmm. Shadow and Spider-Man. Oh! Goodness, Kawada I S -S And a senton. Kick to the thigh. Uh -oh. Headlock. And a hit. Shadow pretty dominant out of the gate. Absolutely. Shadow seems to be in control. But, you know, you Spider-Man, there's been many a match we've seen with him where he seems to be losing the control before getting a flash pin. Oh! Absolutely. Or a flash, flash pin. Oh, he went for the Spidey clutch. Wasn't able to get it. Ooh. Yes, you can absolutely never underestimate the power of Spider-Man. Absolutely not. And if you do, you will certainly regret it. Absolutely. <laughs> punch from Shadow. Whipped off by Spider-Man. Mm. Spider-Man. Into the corner. Follows in with Ooh, another punch. Big punch. And another Good one. And an uh, elbow. Ooh. ooh, bunch of kicks missed there from both men. Oh, those kicks didn't miss, Goodness. though. No, they did not. <laughs> right to the face of those Kawada Shadow kicks. Shadow made sure of that. <laughs> oh, Inziguri. Nope. From Spider-Man. Spider-Man with a kick to the uh -oh. side. Oh, we're getting a kick-chop right, combination. Back and forth. The chops went out of Shadow. That they do. That they do. Ooh. A awesome kick from Spider-Man. Yeah, back absolutely. to his feet. And now he's oh, taking Shadow to the corner. But no, uh -oh. we're reverse. Right. Oh, rolling combo kick in the corner. In the corner. Absolutely brute. Nowhere to go there. Rocking a hard place. Oh, now it's time for Shadow uh -oh. to go into the corner. Oh, what's Spider-Man doing? From the oh, top. Astro Scissors yes. Whip! Goodness gracious. Oh, goes for a big spinning kick but misses. Absolutely an electric first match of the night. Absolutely no nothing less here in Ring of Champions. Oh my! Ooh. Spinning Soul Kick followed up by a Pele Kick. And a flipping Senton. 
Yes, they really are fighting for the King of Flight Championship title Absolutely. tonight. Absolutely. Shadow showing why he deserves to be here. Drop to hold. And now, oh, the Ooh. disrespect going for the Spidey wow. Crunch. Could you imagine if he beat Spider Man himself. with his own move? It would be absolutely. The Maestral Cradle. Brutal. Can you only imagine what that would do to Spider Man? I would. I'd be really worried about Spider Man, especially if he has a big match tonight against Goku. And if he were to Ooh, lose yeah. like that, that would destroy him, I'd have to think. I would think that it would probably affect him, yes, in his later match as well. Ooh, big tornado kick missed. Drop to hold again by Spider Man. And oh, into the Spider Clutch himself. I believe he might be the ropes. No, yeah. not the ropes only, but Guzz can only gets a one. Whipped off into the corner. Shadow runs in, but oh, Spider-Man moved out of the way. Elbow in the corner. Yes, give it oh, enough time. Scissors whip uh -oh. once again. There it is. Appears to have rocked Shadow a little bit. Oh, knee strikes. Into the clenched knees. Runs off, hits the ropes. Comes in. Ooh, wow. penalty kick. Whipped into the corner. Spider-Man runs in. Pop back. Likes to do a Rana Ooh. from there. That rewind Rana. <laughs> But neither competitor staying down for longer than one count. But both these men throwing everything they got at each other. Oh! Ooh. Inward flipping senton there. Incredible. Absolutely. From Shadow. Oh, Just going for to a jackknife pin. Show sure why he's Ooh, one of my favorites. two, almost a three there with that jackknife pin. In Zaguri from Spider-Man. Favorite fighters in the scene right now, truly. Oh, oh Romero special. Wrestlers, not fighters. I mean, they're both. Yeah, yeah, true. true. Elbow to the back of the head, kick to the thigh, and then ooh, another flipping sent on. Spider Man with that drop hold. He likes to twist around and then ooh into the Spidey Clutch. There it is. And that is in the ropes. Spidey Clutch. And then now in control. Elbow to the back. Elbows to the back and of the head. And to the back of the head. Spidey Clutch of his own. Goodness. Two count. Ooh, oh, that was honestly almost, almost me with the Spidey Clutch. Wow. In Ziguri. Spider-Man Moonsault, double stomp off the top rope. Kick to the thigh. Kirk and Rana. Oh. Goes for the pin, but that's in the ropes. It is indeed. If Shadow maintains this Drop momentum, I don't know how much longer Spider-Man's going to be able to last. Ooh, gets a two. Both these men so evenly matched. Those overhand mm, strikes geez. with those kicks. Oh, ooh, big oh. knockout kick of his own. And a standing shooting star press. Goodness gracious. No, not it. Really? Spider-Man refuses to give up. It's only been 11 minutes. Gonna fight his heart out. Well, Make like sure he keeps this as going as long as possible. Camel clutch, but Spider-Man the, the ropes. What they came for. Oh, spinning soul kick to the chest. Oh, and then taunting on him and a standing moonsault. Spider-Man showing caps. that he still has energy enough to be jumping into the air like that. Whips him off. Yes. Oh, inward flipping oh. cutter. Oh, my goodness. Absolutely incredible. Absolutely. Our King of Flight showing us for us. Whipped off into the showing corner. Showing off for us tonight. Spinning neckbreaker out of the corner. Ooh. That's going to be followed by the Pele. Oh! Phoenix! Ooh. 630! Absolutely beautiful. Showing why Shadow he there. deserves to be in this King of Flight division. It's Shadow right here. Truly, Poison even if Rana. he doesn't win tonight, he is put on a beautiful show. Real kick from Shadow. <laughs> Flipping Ooh. into that inward flip senton. Again! The Spider-Man back up to his feet. Whipped off by Shadow. Oh, ducks Ooh. the flying move from Shadow. Back into the ropes. Oh, but wasn't able to duck that arm drag. Shadow's winded, though. Might not have the conditioning Spider-Man has. Might not. Strike combination Ooh. with those clenched knees, ending it. Flipping senton. Jackknife pin! And... Ooh, oh, so another close! Oh! Uh oh Maximum Spider! You can do it, folks. That and is his does. finishing maneuver, folks, and he wins with it. Do not count out Spider-Man. You cannot right. beat him for that King of Flight title. Absolutely not. An incredible showing from both competitors, but Spider-Man going why? Going to show why you should never count him out. <laughs> Absolutely. Title defense successful. There's the fireworks. And a 100% match evaluation. And I could not agree more. What a great contest we saw. And that was only the first match, folks. Only the first match. Now it's time for a tag team contest. As Stan Marsh teams up.
with Kyle Broflovsky making his debut, taking on Nacho with what seems to be maybe Nacho's new protege. Is that Ramsey's? No, well, no, Ramsey's not his protege. Ramsey has more experience than him. I mean, he may have lost their two contests, but he's not. No, his new protege. He's taking him under his wing as of late. The Flea! Interesting. Yes. Both the luchadors, it makes sense. Absolutely. He wants to teach him the ways of the ego powers. Mm. Very incredible, as we've already seen from Nacho. Absolutely impressive victory against Ramses in his debut match. And now tonight, he's in a tag match against the boys from the South Park Dojo. Stan Marsh, Kyle Broflovsky. Without any further ado, let's get to the action. I forgot to do tag team entrances. So we, each man will be getting their personal entrance tonight. Mm. Here comes Kyle Broflovsky representing the South Park Dojo's official theme song. Mm. Yes. Yeah, you can hear Kenny McCormick speaking, who we'll see this Saturday in action. Absolutely, Kenny the Kenny on the mean streak has been Absolutely. Late. Here comes Stan Marsh. He's South Park all around. Always representing the South Park Dojo. Mm. He wants the fans to clap, and they are! Here, here comes the flea. Mm, yes. Representing the Mucha Lucha. Mucha yes. Lucha Universe, a, a very fun show that has sadly been seemingly lost to time. It's a piece of what I believe they call lost media. That is my understanding. There's like one DVD release of the whole one season that existed. Like six of the like 30 episodes is all that exists. Yes. From a, a show that I remember to be quite, quite good. Yes, but does not quite exist. Nacho's theme song playing right now, him singing to his, the love of his life, Incarnacion. Mm. He's wiping his How tears. How incredibly or romantic. Will he be wiping his tears of joy or sadness tonight? Mm. That is the question indeed, my friend. Big slam from San Marsh. Yes, indeed. Stan. Sorry. Oh, nope, you're good. Stan, who had an impressive showing in defeat, in a four-way eliminator recently, mm. eliminated the first two competitors before losing in the end to, I believe, it was Monkey to Luffy. I do believe that's right. On mountain Ooh. punches, but not able to push him off. Right, flee. Choosing to stay that one out. Ooh, big elbow to the back. Oh, looks like he might be tagging in his protege, the flea. It does appear that way. This is the first time we're ever seeing the flea in action. Big Northern Lights suplex to start her off. Oh, went into the mount. Maybe the flea's been doing some MMA training. Whipped into the corner. But wait, reverse. Ooh. Palm strike. Arm ringer. Oh, tagging to Kyle Broflovsky. First time we're seeing Kyle. Oh, double team move from the South Park boys. Double power bomb from the South Park dojo. Whipped off. Oh, goes around. Takes an elbow to the face. Oh, the the ring. Another elbow to the face. Can't get what he wants to do here. In the corner. Ooh, kicked him off. Kyle showing Kyle. he has a little bit more of the strength here. Absolutely appears that way. Lariat in the corner from Kyle. Tag into Nacho. Arm ringer. Double team move. No, blocked by Kyle. Now he's just Kyle raining down punches on Nacho. Overpower with the both of them at the absolutely. same time. Incredible. Showing the strength he has. Ooh. Oh. Overhand chop and a knife edge chop back and forth. Overhand one from Nacho. Whipped off by Nacho. Oh, Ooh. pendulum backbreaker. Big clubbing blow to the back. It's tagging into Stan. Whips off Nacho. And a big knee strike there. And repeated stomps. And two stops. Double axe handle to the back. Tags back into the flea. Double team Ooh. suplex on Stan. Goodness. Goes for a chop and misses. 
The flea whips off Stan, but Stan uses the catch of the ropes to stop his momentum. Goes around, but takes an elbow. Whatever he's trying to go for when that reversing to the back is not worked for him. Boston Crab. Right. Nacho Stan coming in to break it up, though. Stan Booth appeared to have that move scouted. <laughs> Absolutely. They must have done their tape study on the flea. Uh -oh. Double back suplex. And Stan retreats back into the corner, tagging, tagging in Kyle. Corner, tags in the Nacho. Oh, the flea fighting up both uh, opponents this time. Flea and Stan leaving the ring. Our referee is Fair Bear, who will call us right down the middle. Don't you worry, folks. Absolutely make sure everything is nice and clean in this fight tonight. Absolutely. Snapmare is him over. Puts him back towards the center of the ring. And arm ringer. Absolutely. And a he oh, headlock into the punches. Back elbow. Tags into Stan. Can we see a double team maneuver from the South Park Dojo? No. Not able to fight Absolutely off. Fight not. it off. Tagging in the flea. Stan able to fight it off. Goes for a flying Enziguri. Misses on the flea. The flea lifts him off. Oh! Ooh. The Mystica! And then, well, I can just teabag him. Ooh. Butterfly suplex. Beautiful butterfly suplex here. Yeah. Arm drag takeover. But perhaps he calls that the flea suplex. Mm, possibly. Oh! Ooh. Has them all tied up there. Absolutely. What a nasty armbar that was. Absolutely. Whips him off into the corner of the flea. Follows in and a rolling cop of the corner. Wrenching at the, the eyes. Second cop of cooking in the corner we've seen tonight. Absolutely. It's a popular move. Oh! He got what he wanted! Oh, that's it? That's what he wanted the flea? This whole time? Very interesting. Oh, okay. You know what? The I will not question his strategy. It seems to be working for him so far. This match seems very evenly matched. It really does. Yes. Which, you know, you do have to wonder if that makes the South Park boys question themselves a little bit. Oh, big flying splash. I don't know if he got all of it, though. I think Stan might have been in the way. Uh -oh. Big elbow drop. Big elbow. You have to wonder if the South Park boys are questioning how this team, that's this is their debut, are... These guys have been friends for a long time. Over 20 years they've been friends. That's right, and the flea only a very recent protege of Absolutely. Nacho. He, from my understanding, wasn't the protege of the last time we saw Nacho. It's been since the last time we saw him. All right, under a week. Maybe. Yeah, and he's taken him in very well, and it seems that they've been doing some training in that week, and they're already a cohesive team. That's right, perhaps oh, due to the powers armor. of the eagle working Maybe through the Nacho. Powers of the eagle. Oh, he has him in that arm bar with the leg twist. Stops. Knife Edge versus Overhand. Oh, knife the edge Knife won. Edge wins. Absolutely. Flying oh. elbow. Oh, but oh, the flu is able to get yes, Just in time. Very big. Oh, Romero special. Uh -oh. That's going to be in the ropes. Referee Fairbear right there to tell him to get out of there. Throws him to the Ooh. floor. Does... Down to the floor. Oh, I was yelling on a microphone. Where did he get that microphone? Oh, no. Good. He hit uh -oh. the ball behind the referee's back. Not to with the worry in the corner, corner though. The flea whips and off the order Kyle, is restored. The corner. Shoulder tackles Ooh, in the corner. Shoulder tackles, yes. Elbow to the back Ooh. of the head. Oh, goes around, but oh, another back elbow to the back. Ooh, that armbar. But, look right out. Tags back into Nacho. Stand Face the booth off, does Stan goes, the top. goes for a flying elbow on the flea. Ooh, but isn't able to get back up before Nacho gets his hands on him. That is true. Oh, back and forth, overhand versus, I think, punches, honestly. I do believe so. Ooh, Drop kick, big no hands, but we know! Coming right back up, spinning lariat! Big drop what kick, drop kick. all is waiting to it. Goes for a pin, that's really close to Kyle, but doesn't matter, Kyle doesn't even try to come in. He, he had faith in Stan. Right, police, hey, only and one right count from Stan. Because Stan only took a one count there. Big knee. Oh, the eagle power! No, he moved out of the way! That's right, able to avoid that eagle splash. Oh, but miscommunication from the South Park JoJo. Stan fell after Kyle moved, not out of the way. And Got another big drop kick from Nacho. And now monkey flip. Ooh. Kyle getting tossed around here. 
Eagle powers! There it is! Headbutt. Oh, the fleet comes in! But not enough Ooh. to put away. And Kyle somehow will kick enough. out. Oh! Uh -oh. Repeated kicks to the face! Striking kick combination, yes. The flea right there to break up that pin, though. Yes, that that teamwork from Nacho and the flea is quite impressive, to the be training honest. Training Nacho has given the flea. I think this is a team we will see more regularly. I think so. It really feels like the chemistry between these two athletes is quite natural. Absolutely. <laughs> I just can't imagine the wrestler the flea could become if he continues under the tutelage of such a impressive wrestler as Nacho. And he teabagged him once again. Mmm. Goodness. Perhaps that was from before his times under on Nacho's league. I'd hope. Armbar, Fujiwara, but no, broken up. Mule kick. Ooh. Gets out of that. Mule kick. Oh, no. Trying to attack Kyle on the apron, but Kyle short tackles him for his... Ooh. Goodness. Some Northern Lights. Into the corner. Uh -oh. Stan whips him off. But the flea jumped up. Flea, and flea, oh, he whipped off Kyle, and Kyle ran into nothing. Goodness. Super Ooh. kick. Huge super kick. Nacho doesn't Nacho, step in for quite some time. Nacho does not have faith in the flea. Um, maybe not as, you know, well placed as earlier with Stan and Kyle. Perhaps not. Ooh. Big double drop kick. Double drop kick. Good heavens. Off the ropes. Oh, the Mystica. Wow. What incredible. Beautiful tag teamwork there. Absolutely fights him off and goes for a clap. He wants the fans. Start chanting Nacho. Oh, can you not love Nacho? Big drop kick to Sam. I feel up. like the only person in the world who doesn't like Nacho is Ramses. Probably. And understandably so. Nacho does seem to have number. Oh, roll up! But oh the flea! A second too late if you would have got in there to help. Uh-oh. Nacho fighting off everyone. Yes, the incredible wrestler he is. Follow Stan. Big backbreaker. Tags into the extensive fleet. training has, you know, really double increased team maneuver, double his, his ring awareness. Oh! The flea pulls Stan in. But Stan with the punch. The flea not able to stop him from making that tag to Kyle. Oh, but he run, rolls him Ooh. around. Go for a pin, probably, at the end of this. But when will he stop? Nobody knows! He's up there way it too is. close to the rope. Way too close Big splash! Indeed. Oh, but the elbow flea was able to get up before the elbow. Now it will take the double team maneuver there, that splash elbow combo. Ooh. That might have been Goodness. a Rochambeau. You hate to see the ball based combat, but it, it is, is, it is unfortunately a way of the South Park Dojo. The Rochambeau is very oh, important to them. Yes. Top battle. Oh! Ooh. Flying heel kick. Oh, into the Kimura! Ooh, quite far from the ropes. Flea able to fight his way out, though. Butterfly Ooh. suplex. Or the Flea suplex. But wait, oh! Oh! I'd have never seen that move. A submission hold, very... Variation of a camel clutch. Yeah. Flying elbow! And a flying elbow, double Ooh. elbows! More! Hold on. Another Hatch. elbow, three elbows, for the price of one! Ooh, arm ringer and an arm snap there. Double team maneuver. No, Stan fights it off. Falls him into the corner. Oh, he's taking him up to the top. High risk maneuver here. Could be reversed. Could be uh, uh, Big superplex. Tags into Kyle. Double and back suplex. Double back suplex. Oh, Goodness. roll through. This could Stan be it. Not able to miss communication Ooh. there. Stan not stopping the flee. Uh oh, back and double back suplex of the moon. Team. Whips off Kyle, does Nacho, and tries to go for back elbow block. Oh, Kimura. But not able to get out. German suplex Ooh. from the Flea. Flea absolutely not happy to see his mentor being beat up in the ring. Absolutely not. Eager to step in at any chance. Very admirable. Nightmare's down, Nacho. Tags into the Flea. Whips him off. The fleet. Oh no, miscommunication. Miscommunication there. Him. Meeting of minds there between the fleet and Kyle. Mm. Slams him Ooh. down. And a stomp. Off the ropes. Flipping senton. 
Go right. right back up to his feet, Ruin with an elbow. Man, I wish this match had a time limit. As do I. Holy moly, I hadn't really noticed until now. Absolutely. What an insane match. 31 Absolutely. minutes. Have to think at any moment this match could end. At least you hopefully. Hope. I mean, yes. <laughs> Anytime. Oh my! Flying knee! What a brutal knee that was. Absolutely. Big elbow drop. Could he go for the pin? No, he's going to go up to the top again. And a big splash. This could be it. Kyle, could if he can just eight. stop. He is! The South Park Whitey flips off Nacho afterwards and now stands flipping off the crowd! Goodness. South Park boys Rude don't boys. care if they're popular or not. Space not. Our next matchup is gonna be a debut and a return simultaneously. We have the debut of Casey Jones. Mm. I believe of the Ninja Turtles universe, yes. I believe that is where he does hail from. Casey Jones making his debut. Taking on the returning, and only has one match, but did have a win. Tiger the Dark. Mm. That's right. Your referee will be slimer for this time. a big fan of the, his friends the Ninja Turtles coming out to a theme inspired by them mm. that's right though not to turtle himself he does frequently fight side by side along with them absolutely with a hockey stick I believe typically we'll have to see if he has any weapons in the night very possible Tiger the Dark the only weapons he needs are his hands and his feet and it's just him he is the weapon and what an incredibly effective weapon he is. Eternal rival with Tiger Mask, who we have not seen since their impromptu match where Tiger the Dark won. Wasn't even supposed to happen, but they were brawling in the back. What? Picks him up, slams him down, does Casey. Whips him off. Casey starting off hot and heavy. Big shoulder tackle. Goes for the pin. Not even a one. Not even. That's right. Very early to be going for pins here. Absolutely. Only 30 seconds in. But can you imagine if he did get it a un minus minute win? That would be incredible and uh, really rub salt in the wound of Tiger the Dark. Yes. Absolutely. Big elbow from Tiger the Dark. Tiger the Dark with a Boston Crab. Shades of the young boy dojo that he came from. Mm. Slams down, goes for a splash. I don't. Maybe he's just trying to force him to exert more energy with these kickouts. I just have to question going for this many pins mm. this early. Yes. Again. Goodness. Oh. I don't know what Casey's Larry. doing. Oh, has him wrenching in the neck there, but blocked. Look, oh, Casey was going to the corner looking for a tag, but he has no partners tonight. Casey. It's just you versus Tiger the Dark. Is indeed. Big back suplex. No turtles in a half shell in the ring with him tonight. No, no turtle power unless he can muster it himself. Right, but will he be able to channel it in time before Tiger the Dark rips him to pieces? <laughs> Whipped off does Tiger the Dark into the corner. Oh. Shoulder tackles to the shoulder, trying to dislocate it. Mm. And the Ooh. On. Oh! Easy. Ooh! Headbutt to the groin! Has he been training at the South Park Dojo? Perhaps. They're in the mean streets of wherever he hails from. <laughs> New York City, I believe. That makes sense. Five minutes gone. Probably, I would argue, I would think, actually, specifically, the Hell's Kitchen district of New York City, because that's where Daredevil is from. And... I believe, canonically, the turtles were made from the same radioactive waste, at least initially. The same radioactive waste as Daredevil? That blinded him, yes. 
fascinating. At least in the comics. For the turtles. I don't think that was ever in any of the adaptations in the movies or television. Mm. It's not there down from Tiger the Dark. Goodness. And an elbow. Big elbow, yes. That's where Drop misses. Tiger the Dark just kind of watches him do it. Oh, strike combination. Clinch me to end it. Back Ooh. into that neck crank. Oh, tombstone? Uh oh. Big tombstone. Tiger can start putting together some of those bigger moves. This could go Tiger's way for sure. Absolutely. Throws Casey to the floor. Oh, who are going to see dive? Big Tope Suicida. Beautiful. I love to see a good dive. Absolutely. Dives are amazing. Some of my most favorite wrestling oh, moves. Pump handle slam. Tiger the Dark goes around. Back suplex to the floor. Goes into the ring. What a 14 count. Will Casey Ooh. make it in? 15. He does make it in at the 16 count. We have a 20 count here in Ring of Champions. Indeed, Japanese indeed. rules here. Pump handle slam. Goes to off the pump handle. Wow. And almost gets the win. Goodness. You know something he didn't there. German suplex with right. the bridge. Suppose he did. But both Hold men on. seems to be seem to be almost at that point where the other one could hit. They hit that big move. It could be it. Yes, it appears as though that wrestling on the ground really took it took the wind oh, out of both of them. Oh, spikes him down. Another one. Yeah. Oh. Just crunching the neck. That's gonna be a rope break. To the ropes, yes. The ring awareness not there. For Casey, oh, he doesn't have the experience as a pro wrestler under the pro wrestling rule set that Tiger the Dark does. Oop. They're sure to the tackles. Snap suplex. And but that took a lot out of him. Yes, but he does manage to get to his feet before Tiger. Doesn't that doesn't seem to matter though, because Tiger Dark's back in control here. Front chance for into the elbow. Yes, the if top. there's anything we've learned Flying in elbow. D and Ring of Champions, it's you can never count out your other com opponent. Absolutely. Truly. Cannot count out your opponent. They could get a win at any point. Clinch me. Ooh. Oh, rolls through. Schoolboy. Uh, oh. Almost Nearly. enough of that schoolboy. But I think the problem is Kings has enough of that one last big impactful move. Big drop Ooh. kick from Tiger. Yes, I think the next person to land a, a good move. Oh, be, and that's oh my! A brutal oh, bomb! It's right back up to his feet. Flying knee. Flying tiger knee, if you will. Oh, repeated punches. Close to the top rope. Big splash. Is that splash. Rope? It is not, according to the Slimer. So that's oh, it. And no there winner. it is. Tiger the dart. Very unfortunate for Casey Jones losing in his debut match. Absolutely, that will be a setback. It will probably be a little while before we see him again, thanks to that. It just might be. Typically, if you start getting wins in, you get to come back more frequently. It is the name of the game. Absolutely. I believe our next contest is another special singles contest. Mm. As Monkey... D. Luffy takes on Wolf Hockfield. Two men who have been very impressive. Wolf, ups and down. Monkey, we've only seen in one official match, and he got a win in it. I am very much looking forward to this one. As am I, my friend. It's no secret that I'm a little bit of a Wolf Hockfield fan, and you're a little bit of a Monkey D. Luffy fan. I've That's seen I your am. posts on the internet. I am a fan of the One Piece. Yes. Um, so this is going to be a good matchup. I can't wait to get to it. Nor can I. And so without further ado, I do believe we have entrances. I do believe we do. Here comes Monkey to Luffy. Monkey to Luffy from the One Piece realm. That's right, he's set out to be king of the pirates. He is the straw, leader of the straw hats. And oh. from what I have come to understand, he is fairly close at this point. Mm. Very exciting, but will he be able to be king of the ring of champions? That is the question. Wolf Hockfield definitely wants to put a stop to that. Wolf Hockfield wants to prove that he should have been in the tournament. 
He's about 50-50 in his matches, so I'm sure he wants to get back in the winning side of things. He wants to, he wishes he was in that triple threat for the ace title mm. match, but he's not yes, right I'm, now. I'm sure that's exactly where his mind is as well, yes. Big Mongolian Ooh. chop for Monkey. Yelling at Timmy once again. Once again, we have not signed Timmy Turner. I don't know why he keeps yelling for Timmy. I must be a big fan of the Fairly Odd Parents, and who can blame him, really? Absolutely, what a great show. Truly. Oh, tries with Mop, but doesn't isn't able to. Ooh, check his food leg bit. Absolutely, punches to the face. Monkey looking. And Whoa! Ooh. Short arm Larry brought him back in for it. And a big ooh, drop and a big salt. drop kick. Yes. Yeah. The moon salt off that drop kick, just 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 showing off. Honestly, at that point with a move like the drop salt, chops in the corner. Ooh. Well, Hawkfield showing his strength here. It doesn't seem he might have the strength advantage. It seemed that way. Oh, nice axe kick. Oh, and an uppercut. But Monkey D. Luffy's size is very, very deceiving. That is The fair. strength is absolutely not proportionate in the slightest. <laughs> Elbows and an overhand punches. Overhand punch does seem to get the win, but it did take a lot out of Monkey. Headbutt. Ooh. Uppercut. Yes, he has taken quite a few strikes from Will Caulfield in a well, Hawkfield very short of that leg, trying to just dislocate that ankle. Elbow Incredibly the dominant step, offense step, we've seen from Hawkfield so over far. Step toe, face hold. The STF. A bow uh -oh. and arrow. But Wolf able to get out of it. Both men showing their technical wrestling prowess. Mm, absolutely. Headbutt and monkey. And the splash could be it. Needs to be a little bit more fond of the strike based combat. Ooh, and there it is, a big high kick. Jackknife pin. Two. Gets a two. Mm. We're only five minutes in. We're already at two counts for Wolf. Wolf needs to get some of those big moves in. Has him in an ankle lock. Luffy able to fight his way out. a man who's made of rubber with a submission hold, though. It really is. Wolf takes it into the corner, and now it's repeatedly chopping him in the corner once again. Those hard and fast strikes are going to be his Another best bet. huge chop took him off his feet. Oh. Oh! Tiger Driver! Ooh, almost does it with that Tiger Driver. Actually, Ooh! The, that specific variation, he calls it the Wolf Driver. There was the Ooh, Kamigoye. Goodness. Yes, big Kamigoye knee. Shouten Kai! Ooh. Big shot in Kai, yes, from... Oh, Hockey. spinning Ooh. back kick! And a beautiful, beautiful kick And there. a leg drop. Oh, oh. Uh -oh. still haven't looked up what that's called, that moonsault pile driver. <laughs> Elbow to the back, picks him up, and a chop takes him off his feet. Could it be a moonsault back pile driver? <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. I've never seen a move like that. It's technically not even really a pile driver the way he both spikes on their head. I don't know what it is, honestly. In all my years as a rest as a professional wrestling commentator, I've never seen that move. Shout! Oh, no, that's, oh. that's a I'm explosion! It was, it is. And now uh -oh. oh Jackhammer! With the pin! Goodness, that could do it. Oh, that was so close! Oh, wow. could this be the wolf driver! It uh -oh. is! It is! And it's not quite in the ropes. Ooh, that was almost it with the wolf driver. Not quite enough. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Gut. Kamigoye yeah. pulls him in. In front of that Kamigoye nut Can't strike. Such an impressive Combo. strike. Drop kick to the back. Ooh. Takes Wolf on his feet, but Wolf back up now. And an elbow. Oh, wolf he's calling for something. back in control. Oh, Shouten Kai. Goes to pin off Shouten Kai. Could be it. It's a very impressive move. No, not enough. Mm, not quite. Oh, uh -oh there's that. That gum gum pistol. Absolutely, with that nice back foot drop kick to end it. And gets and the pin. It is. That gum gum pistol hits like a truck. Absolutely. Really only goes to show how impressive of a fighter Stan Marsh is, as he was able to take multitudes of that. Absolutely. <laughs> A 
91 after the muscle bomb press. Mm. I think that was the splash he ended it with. I think it was, yes. Now let's see if it crashes when I change match type. It probably will. But we'll hope that it doesn't. <laughs> yeah, but I'm just, just getting the people ready. Mm, yes. Really set their expectations. Yes, absolutely. Who was the ref last match? Was it Slimer? I do believe so. And really, only appropriately so, for this next match, it's going to be for our three-way for the battle for the ace. That's <laughs> that's at least what they're trying to call it. You know, there are definitely a many a man in a certain tournament right now who would argue that they are the aces of this company. But when it comes to people who aren't in this tournament, who feel overlooked, this is definitely the battle of the ace, the three-way dance. Between it's the Homer ace of the undercard, if you will. Yes. But I would feel like if you were to say that to their face, they would punch you right in the mouth. How they dare you might. call them the undercard? It's not their fault they were overlooked for this tournament. We have Homer, Skeletor, and Bonesaw. Three-way dance to claim that they're the ace. No entrances. All, right. All men ready to go. They want to fight. Man to man, who do you have your money on? Oh, I have my money on Bonesaw, but as I say that, you know, Homer is so hard to beat. Skeletor has done it, but he's the only man to do it. Mm. And that's why my money's on Skeletor tonight. And that's fair, but with this being a three-way, I don't know how that's going to change Skeletor. He's not, it's not a one-on-one -on -one against Homer. You've got to think about mm, Bonesaw. That's right. I don't you know. Honestly, any the... three of these men could win. The first place Skeletor got to win was in a four-way. I believe it was actually was a, it a six way? way, but yes, you are right. That's right. He is proficient in multi-man matches. Well, I don't know if I'd call him proficient. He's had one match. I mean, he did win it, but he doesn't have a lot of experience in it. Because, you know, he was, you know, kind of didn't... Wasn't on a couple shows after that big win. That is fair. Winning the first ever match in the company history. Northern Lights suplex there. From Skeletor to the bone saw. And an elbow. But now Homer's right there waiting for him. Gets whipped off. Shock, looks like mm. Skeletor and Bonesaw are kind of fighting. Homer comes doesn't in that and says, hey, don't forget about me. Just because I'm no longer undefeated doesn't mean I'm not part of this match. Ooh, Homer kicking down both men. Homer, who I do have to bring up, is an alcoholic child beater. It is... Well documented. Well documented. Sadly, his contract is ironclad and we cannot release him for these atrocities. Yeah, we cannot. <clears throat> Specifically, the child beating. I'll be honest. Alcoholism is a disease, and it's not his fault. But when it comes to yes. beating his children, that is his fault. Yes, that is always a choice. <laughs> Absolutely. Big elbow from Bonesaw. Bonesaw with a slam. Picks up. Skeletor gets whipped off, though. Skeletor goes to punch Ooh. Homer. Homer throws a chair, but uh -oh. battered back into his face. Goes for a lariat. Miss. Big Ooh, slam down. Big slam. Back, a big sidewalk slam from Homer. Skeletor nope, fighting off both men. That's right. Whips him off. And whips off Homer. Oh, goes to fight Bonesaw, but Bonesaw with the neckbreaker. Mm. Punch from Bonesaw to Homer. Whips him off. Skeletor back Ooh. by jump. He just turned around and ready to go. Figure four. Wow. That's going to be in the ropes. But no. Kicks him away, does Bonesaw. Bonesaw Ooh. gets headbutt. Big headbutt. And a chop from Skeletor to down Homer. There, Homer down. Oh, repeated punches. Punch combination, but oh, interrupted by Homer. Homer, Homer whips them into each other. Oh, and more punches from Bonesaw to Bonesaw Skeletor. Bonesaw said, I'm going to hit this combo. Going up top could be the big elbow. No, he stops in his tracks when he sees Skeletor. Very Makes smart. Slam. Oh. Uh oh. Straight jacket choke there. Mudo. Oh. Mu Mutoso like elbow missed there. Right, Homer was able to get up faster Whipped than off. he could deliver that elbow. Whipped off. Whipped into the Lots corner. Lots of whipping. Homer forward oh. tackles in the corner. Elbow to Bonesaw. Kicks Homer now in the corner. Bonesaw takes a DT from Homer. 
Nice turn to Skeletor. Skeletor with a big poke! Big poke, yes. Patented Skeletor offense, that big poke. The poke yes. of doom, from my understanding, is what he calls it. Mmm. Oh, rolls through into the pin, but no, in the ropes. Fair Bear right there to tell you that's in the ropes. Because he's a Fair Bear. Truly always calling it right down the middle. As you always. Big back body drop. Oop, drops. And punches in return. Absolutely indeed. Oh! Uh oh! Atomic drop. Atomic drop. To Homer. Punches to Skeletor. DDT to Bonesaw. Sidewalk slam to Skeletor. Goes for the pin. Homer lets him go for it. Only gets one though. Another one. Another sidewalk slam. Going up top. Might have been thinking elbow, but Homer picked up Skeletor. Kicks both men down. Goodness. Top stops whatever he's going for. Camel clutch. Both sides will fight out of it. Yes, able to find his Side way out. Of his own. Kick to the back. It appears as though Skeletor <laughs> has a bit to pick <laughs> with, with these men. Has Not really letting either mark. men do much. Fight out of it. Oh, ooh, he's looking to go for that. Don't drop it. Reverse. Throws the chair, but back into him. It gets battered. He really needs to stop trying to throw that chair. It never seems to work from Ooh. Bonesaw Ask Elbow onto Homer from Skeletor. Poke a doom! And a big poke. Sidewalk slam! Homer takes to elbows to the face. Roll through, schoolboy. Bonesaw out oh, of there. there. Bonesaw, there he goes! The man who has ace weight on his tights will not be the ace. We're getting a no, rematch he of sorts not. here between Skeletor and Homer. Can Homer get the win back over Skeletor? Will Skeletor prove that he is truly the ace, continuing his undefeated streak? I would be perfectly fine with oh, that. Oh, donut drop! Oh, that could do it, folks. Darn it. But no! Oh, but only a two count. Skeletor will fight out of it. Oh, that very impressive moonsault fallaway slam. Not something at all you would expect to see from a man of his size. But he is an impressive man when it comes to that wrestling. Another donut drop. That's going to be too close to the ropes. It is very unfortunate. Another moonsault Homer. hallway slam. And now he's going up top. Also still very much in the ropes. Uh-oh. Big crossbody in the ropes. Uh, Throws the chair. Gets battered back at him oh. once again. Off the ropes. And the ropes. Here comes Big Lariat. Whipped off by Homer. Big knee strike. Punch to the face. Whipped him off. Flying Ooh. Heine. But no, stops whatever he's going to go for because he saw Skeletor getting up. I guess he wanted to do like a splash or something. Brain Buster Ooh. before. Homer taking the time he needs to get some his win back here. Only a three count outside the ring for Skeletor. Back and forth punches. Who will get the advantage? So and it's a drop kick. Big drop kick, yes. Big flying elbow oh, missed. Misses. Flying elbow and connected then the from Skeletor. And he's back up to the top. Another and one. And a second elbow. Just, Are we going to see a third? We're not. Disrespectful to Bonesaw after eliminating him, hitting his own finishing maneuver. Which I'll follow slam. slam. Uh-oh. He's fired up. Whips off Skeletor. Back body drop. Throws the chair once again gets battered into his own head. He really needs to stop trying that. It's not going to work. It really Elbow is drop. not. Headbutt! Ooh! Might crack the Takes skull of Skeletor. Takes a headbutt. Might just have. Whips Skeletor his skull a bit. Floor, and he yells in anger. Oh, no, no, no. Don't not drop! Uh -oh. And that smack them in the middle of the ring. No ropes Ooh. nearby, but... Skeletor back up to his feet. the chair once again gets battered in the face because of it. Oh, another elbow. Skeletor with a big elbow drop. Pulls Homer closer to the center of the ring. Could be thinking to end this soon. But no, whipped off by Homer. Shoulder tackle. Homer yelling that he's ready. Oh, off the ropes he comes. Flying Heine. Gets him back up. Uh -oh. oh, no. Choking him. He has still five. And then it's going to end with a big slam. Absolutely, that is. Choke slam. Skelter right back Ooh. up, but takes a DT. Yes, Homer back right up, up into top, the arms of Homer. Big elbow. It's this time. 
Picks up skill. No. Reverse. Oh, all around the big world. Big Still throw the DT. Oh, oh, DDT. Elbow on the that floor. Elbow. Oh, Ooh. belly to belly suplex by Skeletor. Uh oh, uh -oh. There's that, that choke, choke again. again. He has still five. He's gonna use his, a lot of it. He uses the home is getting so angry and desperate. Oh no, donut drop. What? He kicked oh, out! To keep Skeletor down. Big punches from he Skeletor. Kicked out of, I think he's taken four donut drops and gets battered with the chair again. Does off the top Roma. rope. Big uh -oh. elbow, but no! Homer able to move out of the way! Oh no. Uh oh! Suplex from Skeletor! It takes everything out of him. It takes Hooks quite some time to get up. Just Ooh, shoved down. Just shoves him down. Another and big a elbow. big elbow. Going back up for another a one, maybe. A second? A second one. Will we see three? Uh, no, only chance. two. Only two indeed. But no! Sidewalk slam from Homer! Homer up top now. He's going for a big splash. Ooh, That's going to be the rope throw. Splash. Very much, yes. Belly Belly Suplex. Ooh, DDT from Homer. We've not seen Skeletor even Skeletor. try to pull out his sword. We haven't. He's really trying to secure this ace title and make sure there's no <laughs> fumbling about. You know, it's not due to the sword, it's due to his own pure fighting skill. Mm. Really feels like what he's putting out there. Could be. It is weird, though, that he's not using his literal finishing maneuver. Big splash! That could be a pin! Very well could be. Only enough for a two count. Wow! Ooh, oh, Finger Poker Doom! Wait for him to get up. Uh -oh. Flying cross body bats in the ropes. Very much in the ropes, yes. Roll through. I think Ooh, that's Skeletor with the pin. And it is Skeletor with the win! Skeletor proving he is indeed the ace. Absolutely. Absolutely, Skeletor. In parentheses of the undercard. <laughs> Don't let him hear you said that. Okay, I didn't say. Oh. I didn't say a Skeletor. Well, that's implying that our undercard isn't just as exciting. Your, your mind, Skeletor. Small package hold. Mm. Skeletor, your winner. Um, and well, deservedly time. so. It is now time to see. The second matchup of Shadow the Hedgehog came out on the losing end against Spider-Man. Can he tie up today with a win and a loss by beating his opponent? Will he indeed? A second win in the tournament would be big, even though he's coming off a loss. Absolutely. Will Shadow be able to beat Knuckles tonight? In this last of our non-tournament action. Oh, yes. Shadow is in the B block. Oh, right. Knuckles did not make the cut for the tournament. And Very I'm sure sad. he might be wanting to prove something there against Shadow tonight. I think you just might be onto something. Shadow the Hedgehog did already have a match tonight. I'm sure if he loses, he will bring that up. But if he is truly the ultimate life form, he says he should be able to have two matches in one night. I think so. He, he wanted Spider-Man to do it. Spider-Man agreed, but, you know. And Spider-Man had one of the biggest matches of his career coming up tonight in the main event. Yes, in a match versus Goku. Absolutely, right? our main event, Spider-Man Goku. Willing, big tournament match, Spider-Man undefeated in the tournament, willing to take the risk of going into that match a little winded to defend his title with honor. What? Now Knuckles versus Shadow. Punch blocked in an elbow. Takes him down into the full uh -oh. mountain. Oh, just repeated punches! Knuckles starting out hot against Shadow. Oh, strike combination there from Shadow. Yes. Ooh, axe big kick. axe kick. Rolls through. Fought out of it, though, does Knuckles. Oh, contest of strength. Shadow wins very handily, it appears. Flipping senton. Knuckles is absolutely no slouch in strength. Absolutely not. The 
for a pen. There's quite a bit of muscle packed into those noodly arms of his. I don't really understand how it works, to be frank. Big back suplex from Shadow and the front from Centon. Hmm. Oh, a little bit of a chop. And he's mounting him again for those punches. Oh! Goodness! Rain down the fist at a really awkward angle. It was. It looked very painful. Back and forth strikes. Knuckled wins. Elbows That's a huge forward. surprise there. Rips him off. Drop Ooh, kick. Big drop kick. Stomped him. Whipped him off again. Oh, Shote! And a kick to the thigh. Jack knife pin. Shadow looking to secure this ankle lock. Uh, as fast as possible. Well, he wants so to he can make get sure to recovering you know. for his match for B Block next week. Absolutely. Or rather, actually later in the week. <laughs> yes, this Saturday. This Saturday when Shadow fights King. Oh my goodness. What a contest he has coming up this Saturday. Indeed he does. Oh, uh -oh. ties him up. No, it only gets a one. Only one count. There's a name for that move that I do not remember. Actually, I know I think Ooh. they call it the Ode to Peach is the name in canon. Interesting. Because Mario is very uh, is a fan of using it. I see. Power Ooh. slam. Pinch knees. Off the ropes. Sent on. Flipping sent on. Big, big knee. Goes up to the top. Goes for a big fight back on the ropes. It looks like Shadow's been busted open. I see the pool of blood under where Shadow is was laying down. So it does I didn't that's notice coming that. Off it must be coming from like the mouth or something. Don't see it on his forehead. Yeah, there. Oh, yeah. There's a little blood coming from the mouth. That might be internal oh. bleeding. This match needs the referee might need to step in. Slimer might need to step in and end this. You know, Shadow won't be the one to admit that he needs to stop. Absolutely not. Goodness, there is blood all over the ring. Absolutely. Oh! Nice Absolutely choke brutal there. match. Yes, those punches from Knuckles, any one of them could crack your skull out in quite easily. Jack I pin Shadow. Trying to get trying to end this quick. I think Shadow knows that even if he's not willing to quit, that he knows this match is then. Triangle yes. choke of sorts. I think he knows that he is in a bad way at the moment. <laughs> Ooh! Punches, punches to, to his head. already bleeding head. Absolutely. Oh, strike uh -oh. combination from Shadow. Big spine buster, spine to the pine. Oh. Even though our More ring is made punches. with oak. Oh. Mmm. But spine to the oak doesn't oh. sound as good. Up. Oh, penalty kick. Oh, gain of clutch. That's in the ropes. Referee not calling it though. No, this is not fair bear. Mm, absolutely. Big oh. jackhammer. Shout out to Wolf Hotfield from earlier. Almost. Uh -oh. Like Almost. Goodness. And clinch knees. knees. Takes him down. Front 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 big sent on. And a and standing a shooter. Goodness, that could do it. And, and it does. does. I'm sorry, folks, for that um, audio issue there. I don't know what happened. I'm not yawning. Yes. Despite losing to the King of Flight, he does still win against Knuckles in his second match of the night. Very impressive showing from both competitors. Absolutely. Oh, what a match we have next. I just saw the card and I'm excited about this one, folks. I am as well, although I have to worry for the safety of one of our competitors. Oh, he's fine. From what I heard, though, he cannot be killed. Though. No, the next matchup we have is KG Mutoso versus David Arquette. And to no one's surprise, KG Mutoso does have quite a bit more strength. And also more wrestling experience. Not that David Arquette doesn't have any, but right. Mutoso does have more. Definitely Mutoso been in is the scene a longer. Of pure Resu. He is the pro wrestling mascot for a reason. He is KG Mutoso.
which I will say, much better name than Bear Muda. Sorry, the person who actually created me. <laughs> Here comes David Arquette, the red right hand of the Ring of Champions. Mm. You can't kill him. He's David Arquette. That's right. Ghostface tried and failed four times. What? And we'll just leave it at that. Nah. Yeah. <laughs> no need to delve into that any Oh, no, oh, here we go. Touch the strength. Seems both yep. had a pretty evenly matched. Kick to the gut. Chop to the face. Big elbow from Mutoso. Stammers him down. We will typically see Mutoso try to target the legs and go for more of a technical submission victory. That is true, historically speaking. Well, when it comes to David Arquette, I don't believe he's won a match, so I don't know what his finishing maneuver is. Oh, actually, now I do. It's a diamond cutter. Hmm, yes. He also likes to hit the spear. Oh, and take a drop kick to the face. You might not like that, but he does have to do it sometimes. Yes. As do most of our competitors. Suplex oh. to the floor! Goodness! I'll be honest, I don't Who support right back breaking the feet. rules, but David Arquette does have some deathmatch experience. If I was David Arquette, I'd be trying to get some weapons in here and try to even up the odds a little bit. Mm, yes. You're not going to beat Mutoso in a technical wrestling match. match. Oh. And a and jumping pile driver and a Mutoso elbow. Goodness. The way I'm he twists his body to hit that elbow. After that, unlike but Mutoso, else. Bulldog. Oh. Ever the experienced wrestler knows when to try to pin and when not to. Absolutely been wrestling since the 1980s. Mutoso. Absolutely insane. Absolutely. Shoulder tackles. I had heard rumors that Mutoso was planning on retiring this year, but he's changed his mind, it seems. What an incredibly dedicated yeah. figure four. athlete. Truly impressive. Gets out of it. To be sure. Ooh. I just stood the top of the head of Mutoso. From Arquette. Kick to the stomach. Elbow from Arquette. This appears as though uh, Arquette is for going for more of Daylight a kick strike based Mutoso. offense. Ooh. Can do an arm bar. They do make it to the reaps though. Kick to the back. Our cat seems to be trying. Oh, dropkick! Looked like he was going for that knee, but wasn't able to get it. Our cat, arm ringer, and shoulder tackles to the shoulder, trying to dislocate that arm. Yes. Oh, oh takes number to the face. Shout out Bersawa. Chop from Marquette. And now, ooh, punches. A little shimmy. And the last one. Picks him up. And an elbow. And an elbow. Punches. Kick. Oh, he's calling for something big. But no, it takes a back elbow to the face. Drop kick to the knee. It is. That patented bear sour offense. That is Mutoso. That is what Mutoso. What all bears yes. look alike to you? No. <laughs> One is a black bear, the other is a brown bear. Absolutely, I don't know how you could confuse the two. That's true. Arquette picks up Mutoso, elbow to the back. Ooh. And he's saying it's over. Off that elbow, I'd be shocked. But hey, who knows? Mutoso we all know knows those Mutoso power. elbows can be very, very powerful. It might be Mutoso underestimating, though, Arquette. Very possible. And you should never underestimate Arquette because you can't kill that man. Pele kick. Both men down. Mutoso puts it first. Whipped yeah. off by Arquette. Runs in. Larry in the corner. Some the Shining Wizard! Ooh. But somehow, a groggy Arquette up first. Goes for the spear. Misses. Fireman's carry takeover. He's fired up. And I can't blame him. He just absorbed a shining wizard. We're going to see the diamond cutter. We very well oh, might yes. tonight. Off the ropes. Spear! Spears him down. Goes for the pin. For the Is it maneuver. enough? That could be it. No, not enough. Dragon screw leg whip. Trying to go back to those knees. Targeting those legs for that figure four. 
pulls him into the more into the ropes. Yeah. Honestly, it was a choice there from Mutoso. Mm, right. All right, dislocate that arm. Ooh. But oh, he's winded. Doesn't have the and the again stamina goes into that, that Mutoso arm. has in the ring. Back and forth, elbows and chops. Mutoso says it's over. Oh. And drop kick. It might just well be over, folks. It just might be. But no, as I say that, back suplex from our cat. Trying to catch his breath in this moment he has. A much more evenly matched than I would have originally thought. Never count out David Arquette. Backbreaker. Oh, it could be Moonsault. And it is. That could be mm. it, folks. And, it and is. there it is. He Moon may have beat him, but he did not kill him. Ooh, our next matchup is going to be a little bit more striker versus striker as we have Buffy Summers taking on Scorpion. Mm -hmm. Scorpion. There he is. What's his other attack? Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 And here we go. <laughs> here comes Buffy Summers. Who I believe... Did she win her first block match? I didn't remember, to be quite honest. She did. She beat David Arquette in her first block match. Mm. While Scorpion lost to Ryu. Ooh. Will Buffy remain undefeated? Or, or can Scorpion get his much-needed victory to keep himself in right. this tournament? It's still early, but you don't want to have too many losses in a row at the beginning, it's going to be a lot harder to mount those. Come back from that, yes. yes. Like, I wouldn't want to be David Arquette in this tournament right now with two losses in a row. Oh, or, would I. you know, Bear Sawa. But that's a whole different story. Which not someone you'd expect that's to be Oh, and 2 block story. Buffy, Summer, Scorpion, squaring off. Ooh, big axe kick. Scorpion, a man who I believe at some points in his life, at least, I don't know which part of, which, when we took him from the multiverse, Ooh, he does have time travel capabilities as well. At some oh point, he's goodness. undead, from my understanding, I believe. Wait, who? Is Scorpion ever undead, or is that only... I do believe Scorpion is undead, yes. Okay, yes. Scorpion un and Sub-Zero both. Okay. Well, only one of the Sub-Zeros is undead. Hmm. Yes. I think. I'm to, I don't know my Mortal Kombat lore well enough. Uh, so I'll just move on. Buffy Summers, but the point is, Buffy Summers, a fighter of the undead, taking on Scorpion, an undead man. Will he be uh, slayed right. tonight? Very possible. But right now, he's in control over Buffy. But as I say that, just be we're that way. Exchange and Buffy with the advantage at the end. Jackknife pin, but that's, that's in the ropes. Fair bear right there to say that's in the ropes. Oh, roll through. Ooh. That's not in the ropes. That could be it, but no, only one. It's still quite early in the match. Absolutely. But you never know with a flash pin, it could come out of nowhere. That's true. Chops there from Buffy. Yes. Ooh, running axe handle. Be a suplex here, but no Falcon Ooh. Arrow variation. Didn't sit out with it. Oh, went for the kick, missed. Oh, palm strikes and a big kick at the end. But wait, no, she's not done. Off the ropes, running double axe. The hand. double axe. And now punches to the back of the head. That is a referee fair bit right there to tell her to stop. 
she does have to fight. It appears though Buffy intends to slay a scorpion here tonight. That does seem her intention. But Scorpion is telling her to get over here because he's not done. Hmm. Ooh. Big kick. I'll throw up again. The double ice handle again. What yep. a anticlimactic Ooh, and move. to the front. What an anticlimactic running move. The double ice handle. Truly. Headline. Quite vanilla, to be quite honest. Absolutely. Might need to talk to her about maybe trying to find a different move for her arsenal there. Mm, yes. I come to understand she's quite a capable martial artist. Absolutely. As we're seeing with the rest of her offense. She really likes those short arm chops though and the Rochambeau. Nothing against taking the advantage that you have there. You do have five seconds for any illegal maneuver and she didn't kick him in the nuts for five seconds so she's technically alright. Yes. Oh, knockout punch! Yes, big knockout punch. Oh, almost. almost knocked him out! Almost, yes, truly did Let's knock see. him right kick out. to the leg. Oh, palm strikes and kicks. And oh, a nice big kick at the back of the head there. Back, like, mm. Mixed between an Enziguri and a roundhouse. Top combination. Uh -oh. Top strike. Oh! A true knife edge chop right to the eye. Uh oh! And there's that double kick followed by the kick to the back of the head. Oh, but there's those chops to the neck. And now and punches, mounts him with punches. more punches to the face. Referee asking if Scorpion gives up to punches. It's not exactly what I would call a traditional submission but at all. Technically, you know, it could force him into submission. I've seen it happen in MMA fights. Yes. Ooh! Romero into the Dragon Sleeper. Romero Buffy Dragon does Sleeper. fight her way out. I'll pop oh. out face. Oh, she's fired up. But no, now palm strikes of his own. Looping palm strikes there. And then, oh, palm strikes with that kick coming in. And now she's going for that amazing double axe hit. <laughs> and a demo yeah. German! Ooh. And that and does it. it. Buffy Summers Incredible. still undefeated in this tournament. Showing that a girl can get it done. Absolutely. I didn't really think that was... Yeah, well, you know. No, you're right. I mean... People people probably don't think that. Ooh. I'm sure people would be... That's I'm sure there are people in this tournament, I'm sure there are fans watching at home who will look at her and go, she is just a girl. But she's gonna come out to that amazing song, She, I'm Just a Girl, and take it back. I think she should probably do it to tub thumping, in my honest opinion. I just don't feel like that makes sense for this specific character. Maybe a different character coming out to I Get Back Up Again would make a lot of sense. Yes. A certain character that I have heard rumors will never get signed. And rightfully so. so Insufferable she is. Whoa, I didn't say it. I only thought it. Hmm. Raven versus... Oh, da oh my goodness, Raven versus Danny Phantom? Yes, I know. I was looking at that and lamenting it because I like both of these competitors what quite a, a lot. What a contest. Raven, Danny, Phantom. Although, if I can be honest, I am rooting for Raven. Mm, girl power all the way. I can't wait for the point in the big crossover movie where they all stop what they're doing to meet up together. Yes, but beyond the girl power, Raven just was an incredible fighter. Oh, absolutely. In a I was just the making King another Avengers joke. Oh, yes. Fair enough. <laughs> I'm Absolutely just making fun valid. of the Avengers universe. Because, you know, I actually, you know, Raven's a great example of how... Raven, Buffy are great examples of how you don't have to ham fist that. You can just make a very well-made female character. Yes, and make them really cool. Yes. And make everyone want to be like them. <laughs> yes. And here comes Danny Phantom. And speaking of really cool characters that everyone wants to be like, Danny Phantom, here we are. But I wanted, Mary... to, be, I wanted to be Box Ghost. Um, mm. <laughs> you wanted to be Box Ghost? Oh, and I was mixing up the Lunch Lady and Box Ghost, you're right. Mm. Tombstone Piledriver to start her off! What a Ooh. opening maneuver! <laughs> no, I wanted to be my own uh, OP Box Lady. 
Well, it's his wife. Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, back to the action at hand. That was yes. an ad break. Uh, <laughs> big slam there from Raven. Danny Phantom mm. back in the ring, coming at her. Danny Phantom may be mis oh. misunderstanding Raven's powers and thinking she is a ghost, but she is not. She is just the daughter of a demon. That's right. So still dark and evil, but not in the same way. But also, right, she is still herself entirely not. alive. Yes, she herself is not dark and evil. Headlock. Danny Phantom may will get out of it. Suplex. Oh, no reverse. Oh, but a diamond oh. cutter! Hitting what Ooh. David Arquette wasn't able to earlier. That's right, and a move like that this early in the match could be quite advantageous. This move, this match started with a tombstone pile driver! All right, traditional it? conventions are out the window tonight. Starting very hot and heavy in this match. Backboard strike combination now, overhand and knife edge. Knife edge wins out. Off the ropes goes Danny Phantom. Big Larry to Raven. Raven, who is currently does not have a win in the tournament. Well, I believe Danny Phantom also might not. Neither one has won. Danny Phantom losing to Mutoso and Raven losing to Spider Man. Mm. Yes, yeah, quite a quite a rough matchup there. Absolutely. You could argue both people had a rough opening round matchup. Absolutely. Spider-Man undefeated as well as Muto. So. Well, not undefe undefeated in tournament action. He did lose to Bersawa on the debut show. Mm, that is true. But Bersawa hasn't been able to get a tournament victory under his. No, he is not. He's 0-2 at the moment. Very unfortunate. Oh! Uh oh! Splash Mountain! Ooh, and that Goodness, was almost a Splash almost Mountain! A three count. And a diamond Six cutter minutes over in! A jumping diamond cutter there. Raven really just out here to prove that she is indeed one of the best wrestlers in Absolutely. this company right now. Absolutely. Took Spider-Man to his limit. Brain Buster! Mm. Almost winning yes. the King of Flight title on our last show. Absolutely. That Brain Buster almost put her Ooh. away, though. Look for that jumping diamond cutter missed. Tombstone Power Driver is going to hit, though. Ooh. Goes for the penalty tombstone. And she goes Doesn't hit the leg, though. Have to wonder if she would have hit the leg if that could have been it. Very could have been, very well could have oh. been, yes. Has him in a submission hold. But he able to he's able to fight out of it. Oh, but uh -oh. now into right, an armbar. Into an armbar. But into the ropes. It's for a big spinning kick, misses. Could be another one of those brain busters. And it is. Ooh. The way he folds up the body, goes for the pin. But do it, folks, but it's not enough. Not enough to do it. Both these people Both are trying these. to go for it. They want a quick, nice, easy match tonight, these two. Yes, they're really putting oh, their all into it to make sure this ends as fast as possible. But Arquette, or not Arquette, Danny Phantom able to get to the ropes. Mm, very fair, they both do do the diamond. That is true, that is why I confused it. Not because they are two white men. Uh oh! Oh, she oh, crippled him with that splash goodness. button! She knocked him out! Locks the life right out of Danny Phantom, metaphorically speaking. I do believe he is still alive, though. Very impressive victory from Raven. One of my favorite wrestlers. Absolutely. And we're about to see one of my favorite wrestlers as Ryu takes on Leatherface. What we've called before the King of Monsters. He does have a claim at that. He does indeed. He's, he's beaten Godzilla himself. Absolutely. In the ring. With such a title on the line, he would have one. Luckily for Godzilla, it wasn't. <laughs> Ooh. Leatherface Old showing school. up in his business, his, his fancy clothes. Right, perhaps he'll have a meeting with the Illuminati. <laughs> oh no, uh, let's get to the action. <laughs> We don't talk about that one. Yeah, we do. No! Ryu making his way to the ring from the Street Fighter universe. Smaller for rooms. The yes, wandering the... warrior has wandered his way into a battle with Leatherface. The... Not quite titular protagonist, but, you know, 
He is the face of the company of yeah. Street Fighter. I feel like he's one of the least popular characters, really, but he is the main character. That is true, yes. Here comes Leatherface. Very intimidating, as always. It does look like his shirt doesn't quite fit, though. It does appear a little bit small. Leatherface taking strikes there from Ryu. Ryu seems to be trying to get the control here at the beginning. Oh, wrenching the eyes. Understandably, Sue. Ryu likes to go for like those knockouts. is no one to be underestimated. Absolutely. Ryu likes to go for the knockouts, while Leatherface likes to use weapons. Will we see a scythe? Will we see a fork? Who knows? Very possible. We can absolutely guarantee we will see plenty of shoryukens from Ryu. There's one. There's one. As I speak. You're at home. Don't play a drinking game with it. You will die. Yes, you will. Absolutely will die of alcohol poisoning. And if somehow you don't die from alcohol poisoning, Leatherface might be there to kill you. Allegedly. No backflip out of the corner from Ryu. Very impressive. Okay, from Leatherface. And now, oh, just a slap to the face of Ryu. Whips off Ryu, but he flips out of the corner. But right into the arms of Leatherface. Double knees. An elbow from Ryu. And a short, you kidding. That's two shots if you're counting. Please don't. And three. three. Oh my gosh, that's four and in such a short time. It's only been three minutes! Ryu heard the words drinking game and started throwing out Shoryukins as fast as humanly possible. Please, for the love of God, do not be drinking right now. If... Oh, running big boot from Leatherface. Knee to the back of the head from Ryu. Ryu goes for the pin off that knee. Gets a two. Wow. We could have with those yeah. Shoryukins. There's and five. the Shoryuken. Fifth one. Flips off the corner. Oh, and there's the fork! Oh, He's busting wide the open immediately! The blood pouring do, down. Fire up Ryu. Through the kickbacks, they need a shot in the fork and the scythe before every match. No, absolutely. Hilarious! Oh, light race. Another one! Short arm and regular! Ooh. He does all the varieties of lariats. Oh, to the head. Oh, uh oh, press slam. Big press oh, to slam the floor. Up to the floor. And Leatherface fixes his pants. He wants to look presentable. He is wearing his Sunday best right now. Even though he it's is Tuesday. Indeed. Uh oh, mounts him. Mounted elbows. elbows to the back of the head. Technically, I guess not illegal according to the ref. Yeah. But it's not yeah, true, sure. and that is six. Ooh. He's Striking the pose up. there, and goes for the pin. I have to wonder if that time he took for the pose might have been the time he needed mm. to win. Very well, could have been, Two yes. Two to the floor, and Leatherface is exactly what at. I was thinking. Look at his teeth. Seven. Good heavens, folks. And that's almost it, but not quite. Not after the way Leatherface. And Leatherface, back to the fork. <laughs> Do you think so we're going to do double Let digits? Let we all watched it. Stop acting like you didn't do it. One, two. Three right back up to his feet and into the ring. Oh, right into the uh -oh. arms of Leatherface. Powerbomb. Two. Oh, no. Oh. Into the oh. Death Valley Driver. Oh, Goes yes, to the nice. pin. Double powerbomb Death Valley Driver. That very well. Oh, but only that a That was two almost count. it. Wow. It felt so close. And then a spine oh. buster. Spine to the pine. Had him in a claw hold. Now he's got him up for a suplex to the floor once again. One, two, three. Ryu back in the ring. A bloody man. And he takes it overhead yes. belly to belly. He goes flying, does Ryu. Both men up to the feet. And get up at the same time, though. Another Both. Death Valley Driver drops he's him right winded. on his head with that his Death Valley Driver variation. Two. Oh, 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 oh. Two point that was getting close, closer. Folks. Punches and elbows. Super Ooh. kick from Ryu. And a flat. Kicks him right back down. Yes, yeah, nice actually can amount to punches. Ooh, apparently these ones also not illegal. Well, I think he was actually hitting with a little bit of the palm. Not quite a punch. Mmm. 
Those are closed fist Ooh. palm strikes. Oh, most. Uh oh. A kick combination from Ryu. Now he's going on the apron. Springboard Ooh. flying wheel kick. Very impressive. That's in the that is in the rope. Fair pair. Good heavens. I'm glad it didn't get two or three counts. Oh. Been... oh. The Duncan. But not Absolutely enough in the ropes that time. That time the referee noticed. Oh my gosh, he jumps and looks to the floor! Literally shooting balls of key in the ring. Insane. Floor slam! Ooh! Slams him right down. He's putting his dirty fingers in the hole in the cut! Ooh. And that was enough for the win. Leatherface meant continues to be undefeated. Truly a monster in the ring. Will anyone be able to overcome him? Find out, well, next week. <laughs> well, yes. Unless he chooses to take a match on Saturday, you never know. That's also I true. I doubt it, but you never know what he'll want to do. <sighs> it is time for our main event. Goku. versus Spider-Man. Spider-Man undefeated. I'll be honest, maybe the true ace of the company. He's been on every show. He's defend he's Absolutely. And he's undefeated. Goku I don't know if Goku's had a win yet. Yes. Maybe B you, he did beat uh, Ryu on the first show, but he did lose in the tournament to Leatherface. Mm. That is true. And now he's fighting Spider-Man who has beat a who's who of competitors. Undefeated, it's Spider-Man, Goku. Here we go. That's right. Competitors who really, outside of fighting Spider-Man, have not taken a loss. Raven, Shadow, um, other Liger competitors, I'm sure. Yes, Tracker. showings against him. Spider-Man has come out on top every time. Will he be able to do the same against Goku tonight? Goku and prove himself to be perhaps not only the king of flight, but the king of the company. Absolutely. You have to think that a match against Skeletor, or honestly any of those men, even if they in losing, still might claim that they're one of the best. He hasn't had a chance to fight any of them because none of them are high flyers, so they, he, they don't challenge for the king of flight title, which is the only time that we see Spider-Man out of tournament right now. Mm, yes. Here comes Spider-Man. There he is, the Spider-Man. We've seen him once tonight. Can he win two tonight? Starting Breaking off quite hot here. Nice and in control, swinging net breaker. Standing oh. superstar press, could it be it that quick? No. No. Although still, very impressive offense for Spider-Man already. Top of oh. Rana. Top from Goku. I was wondering if Goku was gonna get any offense in, and it does seem like he is now. But no, as I said, the Spider-Man able to reverse that suplex. Snapmare's mm, over though. Snapmare down. Whips him off. Drop down. Low. Went under his legs. Like a yeah, Spider-Man speed. Slippery and little spider. Agility is, is incredible. Standing moonsault. Doesn't even get a one. Misses that kick. Goku just kind of sidestepped it so slightly. And Spider-Man proving that he's not only an expert in the world of agility but also in terms of his strength he Goku is still to be the strongest but spider-man says i might be i may be faster but i'm also stronger than you i just might be yes he's stronger than the strongest faster than the fastest it's spider-man oh big back elbow into a headlock no fight, fights out of it Rick's right face, to does trying to rip that mask off Trying to find out who's under the mask. As from what I've heard, many people are. We could all be Spider-Man. Hmm. It could indeed. Sleeper hold. Spider-Man will fight out of it almost immediately. Oh, he hits that spinning soul kick that time. That's the beauty that of the mask. Hold. Absolutely. From what I've heard. Hmm. Big front flip Slipping sent on. Yes. Oop. Flips him off. Oh, big Larry. Big Larry. Oh, power bomb? No, you don't want to try to power bomb him. He'll hurt Reversed. him. Right Ripped off into the corner. 
punches. Yes. Spider-Man absolutely an expert at using his own opponent's momentum against them. Absolutely. And whenever you think it's time to count out Spider-Man, he finds a way to come back. Absolutely, that's right. Suplex from Goku. Goes for the pin off that suplex. It's a one. Slams him on the mat. Goes Ooh, for hooks the leg. I think he's definitely just trying to force Spider-Man to exert down. energy at this point. Yes. Spider-Man, who Those already had the match. Punches. Goku, who was coming into this match fresh. He definitely has an advantage. Goku, you know, and in Goku's mind, you know, it's not like he should feel bad about that advantage. He's He chooses to, you know, he's in a tournament. He doesn't have to wrestle more. Spider-Man chooses to wrestle more. He doesn't have true. to. Just the man he is. The right, Spider perhaps man it's he is. honestly something he enjoys, you know. Absolutely, dropkick. Something he did before he became a superhero, from oh. what I understand. Neck neckbreaker. Off the ropes. Flipping set on. Goku back up. Punches. Go down after that seventh punch. Spider Man super appears to be kick. a bit dazed. Ooh, a huge super kick. Gets a two off of it. But Spider Man. Oh, it looks like he tried to pick him up, but wasn't able to. Back body drop there. Wow. Sleeper hold. But to the ropes, Spider Man goes. This really does feel like it could be anyone's match tonight. Papa Brana has them all tied up. It's two. Fans respect that. Don't know how you couldn't. Ooh, back elbow. Goku off the ropes. But oh, Spider Man on the side step. Spidey clutch! There it is. Could do it. Only two. Looked into the corner. Oh, but wait. Ooh! Ooh, damn it. Starts that flip. Not enough with that Yoshi tonic. Oh, spinning kick to the face. Super kick to the face. Ooh! Folds him up. It's somehow not in ropes. I would have thought it was, but referee Fairbear always calls it right down the middle, so I will trust his judgment. Mm. Spidey clutch. That's also, I would have said, also somehow ropes, not okay. in the ropes. At least he's being fair. Both men getting it the same. Calling it right down the middle. Mm. Now, Frog surely splash. that's in the ropes. Yes, mm. yes, that is. Spider Man was halfway out of the ring. Flipped over. Back by drop oh. to the floor. Goku falls him down, though. Doesn't, doesn't go for anything right oh! away. Oh! Maximus went on the floor! Goku picks right back up Brain Buster! Both Super competitors kick. fighting their hearts out on the outside. Is it going to be a counter out victory? Spider Man in the ring. 17. Oh 18, my goodness. 19. Oh! oh 19. 19. Super but kick. It's not quite enough. Oh my goodness. Oh, that was almost it. That very well could have been it, folks, but it's not quite. Frog Splash, that's oh. definitely in the ropes. Off the ropes. Around the uh -oh. world. Oh. Scissors. Takes him Take down. Take over. Jumping Jumps up in the air, in showing the air. that he's still got lots of energy left in him. Poison Rana. Follows him down. Recognizes he's in Spidey the ropes. Clutch. Spidey clutch. Two. 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 Literally not a single loss in his record. Truly impressive. No, there is not a loss in his record. I am getting word that it is time for us to announce some matches for next week. In non-tournament action, we will see Monkey D. Luffy versus Skeletor. Goodness. All these matches are making my heart tear in two. Truly. Spider-Man will be defending his King of Flight title against Tiger the Dark. Ooh. Could be and quite then, a riveting match. We'll, there will be four more matches that we will not announce right now. But then in tournament action, we have Kenny McCormick 
taking on Sonic. Shadow taking on King 2. Mitsuharo <laughs> Bear Sawa versus Mario. Sub Zero versus Eddie Gordo. And if you can do your math right, that means our main event is Zangief versus Godzilla. Mm -hmm. What a night of action we have in store for you this Saturday. Saturday. And yes. I will announce right here, just so it's in the YouTube video, in case you're someone who discovers this but wants to come watch us on Twitch. This is going to be the last Saturday for a little bit. We're going to have two weeks where we're going to be doing it on a Friday. Friday the 15th and Friday the 22nd will be, instead of the Saturdays, those two weeks. Will be Ring of Champions. Slightly changing up the schedule there. Just for two weeks. Then we'll be back to Tuesdays and Saturdays. But this Saturday, make sure you're there. Yeah. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.